That's place. I'm here again at Hyatt Hall, St. Michael. This is the one Hyatt Hall mall here, which has a Mark Pharmacy. That's it. Heading down towards where the other Haggard Hall Mall is. Yes, guys. This is Haggard Hall. Looking back at the shop here, like I was telling from my sphere. And this is the one Haggard Hall Mall here. Yes, guys, another bank, another part of the one Haggard Hall Mall here, which has Subway, restaurant, Starbucks, coffee shop, Scotia Bank, Mac Fries. Here, Shepherd and the Harcourt Carter Optical and so on. And down this line would have been where the standard appliance store was, and also where the along this way we will come across the we will come across the um Slam 101.1 radio station. And this is all the Sky Mall here, which was once Julian Supermarket. Oh, you want Haggard Hall Mall? So, this is Haggard Hall in St. Michael. Sky Mall over here, which was once Julian Supermarket. This way will lead you back to the bottom of the highway, the bottom of Haggard Hall, that will lead you back to the Norman Nurse roundabout. And this is the mall here that has, this, this is the complex here that has Cargo, BGI, which is a freighting company. It has Slam 101.1 FM, 103.3 FM, Levada's Laundry, Sherwin Williams, and so on. Standard appliance store used to be in here for years, and then it was. Ashley Furniture for Little Wealth. Oh, Sky Mall here. Back at the Luan Hyatt Hall Mall, here at Shepherd, Sports the Bank, Harcourt Card, Optical, Signia Globe. And so on. Ron Hyatt Hall Mall. There is the one Haggard Hall Mall. I'm back at the shop again. I, I will tell you for banks. And this road here will lead you back to. Two Mile Hill and back to the Lloyd Erskine Sandyford Centre. You can see the Lloyd Erskine Sandyford Centre from here, which was once Serbo and Conference Centre. This show will be back to the Governor General's residence at Government Hill and back to the Prime Minister's residence at Illawarra Court. 
and will also lead you back down to town as well via Two Mile Hill and Government Hill. statue here. Bus around the bottom of the Emancipation statue. Again this is Sky Mall here. So this is Sky Mall here which was once Julian Supermarket and uh, previously Mall International Wait, it was Julian Supermarket first back in the 90s and then it was Troy Mark Supermarket in 2003 then in 2012 it was renamed it was in 2008 it was renamed it was renamed Mall International and then in 2012 it was renamed Troy Mark so this is all a part of the ABC highway here. All Sky Mall here. So this is the section of the highway now that will lead you back to the Warrens and back to the north of the island and back to St. George as well with Salters and the Norman Mills around about. And they will lead you back to University of West Indies at KFA campus as well. So this is the Emancipation statue, which is otherwise referred to as the Buster Roundabout, which was carved by local sculptor Carl Bud Hagen in 1985. The statue was carved here while the ABC Highway was building in the 1980s. So this statue is the picking buster breaking the chains off his hands, symbolizing the ending of slavery. Buster is one of our national heroes here in Barbados. Buster is one of our national heroes here in Barbados who led the slave rebellion in 1816. This is the Buster statue here. So this is the only representation of Buster in Barbados. Yeah. This road here will lead you to the east of the island at Bailey's Plantation and back to St. Philip with St. Philip with six roads, Bearfield and Ruby. So at the Grand, I mean Buster led the slave rebellion at Bailey's Plantation in 1816, where Eddie Grant, musician, a famous musician in Barbados by the name of Eddie Grant has his studio at Bailey's Plantation in St. Philip. So this is the ABC Highway here. Wait for the plan of Tom Adams, who was Barbados' second Prime Minister. Tom Adams was Barbados' second Prime Minister, who 
what invented the ABC Highway, Sally did not live to see it completed. Tom Adams died in 1985 and the highway was completed by 1989. The highway was completed by 1989. Four years after Tom Adams died. There's Sky Mall here again, which was once a mega supermarket in the 90s by the name of Julien. And then in 2003, it was renamed Primark Supermarket. Then in 2008, it was renamed Mall International. And then in 2012, it was renamed Sky Mall. Again, the bustle statue over here. Thank you guys for watching now and have a blessed evening.